It's one of the older hotels in New Mexico, but it's in bad shape and the owner is struggling to fix it up. Now a local historian hopes to raise money to restore the 114 year old railroad hotel in Belen. New 13's Francesca Washington shows you. Empty chairs and dusty tables sit abandoned in the Kuhn Hotel in Berlin. It's been vacant for many years. The hotel first opened in 1906, right next to the railroad station. It was for the conductors and the engineers and the railroaders. Joan Artiaga says her grandfather owned the building in the 60s. She bought the 35-room hotel in 2003 with plans to turn it into an artist co-op. So that uh, the artists that were part of the co-op would have shows and have a gallery and uh, have classes. Artiaga says she was able to fix the foundation and electrical system inside, but says the restoration stalled when her husband got sick. After he passed, I got real sick and was laid up for a couple years. And so... Now I'm getting back on my feet. Artiaga says her goal now is to fix it up enough so someone else will buy it and give it a makeover. And I've had a couple offers on the property and they want to tear the building down and use it for the land. But I don't want to do that. I, I really, I would like to save the building. Over the years, Artiaga says she's had to deal with vandals throwing rocks into windows and cutting through fences to get onto the property, making an already challenging renovation more difficult. I'm afraid to go in there now and see what they did. Last week, Boleyn historian Jim Sloan created a GoFundMe to help repair the old hotel. The $100,000 they hope to raise will go toward fixing the roof, windows, and stucco. Locals say buildings like this one are what make Boleyn so special. Because once that those buildings are gone, you know, people forget about what was there. Francesca Washington, Care QE News 13. The organizer of the GoFundMe has also gotten responses from community members about volunteering their time to help with the labor.